welcome to the instrumentation course life sciences we are uh, i am here for uh, for the uh, unit number first course uh, containing instrumentation in unit number first okay. uh, that unit number first contains centrifuge the topic we are uh, discussing now centrifuge is what centrifuge is instrument that are used for separation of the fluids of different densities or liquid liquid from solids okay that centrifuge is the instrument applicable for the process of centrifugation the centrifugation means what the centrifugation means the separation of fluids of different densities okay we are uh, done the uh, separation of the liquids from the solids or liquid with a different densities of liquids we discuss in centrifugation that principle of operation that diagrams of centrifugation types of centrifugation their applications history safety measures for the centrifugation operation preventive maintenance and common failures basic troubling of centrifuge this is the diagram of the centrifuge that basic centrifuge we use uh, for the uh, laboratory work that instrument contains rotor and uh, the tube holders for that we uh, we input a tubes that contains the sample that was we wanted to separate or we wanted to uh, centrifuge that sample okay principle of operation principle of operation of centrifuge is centrifuge is piece of equipment generally driven by an electric motor okay we use the electric motor for that centrifugation for the revolution of that centrifuge the centrifuge is revolve that shown here in this diagram that revolutions was occurring and the centrifugal field was applied centrifugal field was applied and that had the fixed axis that axis was fixed and that force centrifugal force was applied to that sample that makes the separation of that substances with different densities in that solution okay centrifuge is a piece of equipment generally driven by electric motor that puts an object in rotation around fixed axis applying a force perpendicular to the axis the substances of different densities that force applied by the centrifugation was perpendicular to the axis of rotation okay. the tubes in the centrifuge are tilted majorly the tubes in the centrifuge that containing the solution that was tilted in can pull denser substances towards the bottom of the tube the denser substances in that sample of the tube that was uh, that was in uh, centrifuge or that was uh, is at the bottom centrifuge at the bottom by centrifugal force relative centrifugal force rcf was the relative centrifugal force that relative centrifugal force was applied to the sample for centrifugation of the sample okay. rcf that relative centrifugal force rcf is r w square per g that r was distance from center or motor to the sample that's w angular velocity and g was the gravity that was 9.8 per meter uh, 9.8 meter per second square that's gravity okay principle of operation of centrifuge that input ac voltage ac voltage is the input that was um, used or that output gets rotating rotor 
means the ac voltage is used for rotating the rotors and the mixed solution be used for the centrifugation that gives density separated layer after centrifugation process was operated that was the diagram of the basic centrifuge that gives us timer okay that gives us timing of that centrifugation process we done here and that was rotor okay that's the structure of rotor and the power lead that gives us uh, information about that electric current lead power gives us the information about the current pass on for that rotor for the rotation of that centrifuge okay the diagram of the centrifuge is power source that shows power source motor motor used for the rotation of that centrifuge power source for power of electric current supply okay safety switch a uh, power indication lead timer for indicating the timing of that centrifugation process power distribution board is also there okay that are all showing the uh, centrifugation instrument parts okay next we see applications of centrifugation the major application of centrifugation is the separation of solids from the liquid or separation of liquid with different densities okay that uh, according to that separation was done according to size shape density viscosity of that medium and rotor speed also affect the separation of that samples okay uh, there are the now we see the applications application is the major application is the separation okay uh, under uh, used under urinalization to separate disease identifying components that's uh, used for the urine analysis to separate the disease identifying components and also useful for the separation of the blood components that plasma and cellular components are separated by using centrifuge okay we use for the urine analysis also and for the blood sample separation also okay that uh, the diagram shows the diagram shows us uh, plasma separation of that uh, blood plasma and cellular components are separated by blood sample by uh, using the centrifugation that cellular components are separated and that plasma was the liquid content of that blood are separated by uh, using centrifuge okay next we see the types of centrifuges centrifuge major three types of centrifuge are used uh, that are low speed high speed and ultra centrifugation that low speed high speed and uh, ultra centrifugation having a, a speed differences okay centrifuge that low speed centrifuge are useful uh, or is used at relative centrifugal field 3000 to 7000 is used at 3000 to 7000 g with speed or relative centrifugal field is at 3000 3000 to 7000 gravity okay that high speed centrifuges high speed centrifuges having a speed 6 lakhs gravity okay useful for the 6 lakh gravity and that ultra centrifuge that ultra centrifuge is further divided into two types uh, preparative ultra centrifuge and analytical ultra centrifuge that ultra centrifuge 
uh, in that preparative ultra centrifuge and preparative ultra centrifuge is useful for the 6 lakhs 6 lakhs gravity speed and that relative and that relative ultra ultra centrifuge relative ultra centrifuge relative ultra centrifuge for up to 50000 sorry up to 5 lakhs of gravity up to 5 lakhs of gravity can be used okay 5 lakhs gravity and that also contains variable temperatures in that means uh, refrigerated centrifuges are also there means the low temperature containing centrifuges uh, centrifuges that works at the low temperature that centrifuges are uh, known as refrigerated centrifuges uh, means that uh, centrifuges also having variable temperature operating uh, means temperature variable temperature at operating processes we can apply for it and also vacuum capabilities are different for the different centrifuges next we see history of centrifuge english military engineer benjamin robbins 1707 to 1751 invented a whirling arm apparatus to determine a drag in 1864, Antonin Pandel invented the first dairy centrifuge in order to separate cream from milk. Okay, means that scientist firstly used for the centrifuge for the uh, dairy product that was milk for the separation of the cream from milk. Next, uh, in 1879, Gustav de Larval demonstrated the first continuous centrifugal separator making its commercial application feasibility. Next, there are the safety measurements for the centrifuge. Centrifuge was the instrument, was maybe the dangerous. If we not uh, use it properly, it's uh, dangerous to us. Means, uh, when we uh, use a centrifuge, we must balance that centrifuge tubes in that uh, centrifuge okay we uh, unbalance the centrifuge may defect that rotor or uh, may uh, that centrifugation was not proper and also the instrument of the centrifuge may uh, damages okay that uh, that avoiding revolves per minute is uh, we can enter at the rpm in centrifuge and timing of that centrifuge we can enter on the uh, centrifuge instrument okay and uh, close the lead turn timer on press start and then uh, at the pressing start button our centrifuge was started you remove the tubes carefully after the centrifuge has completely stopped uh, spinning to prevent remixing okay then uh, here is the unbalanced centrifuge the result of the unbalanced centrifuge that may harmful uh, to the our instrument also and we also okay so balancing of the centrifuge is important next preventing maintenance okay uh, maintenance of the instrument is important thing always for efficiency of that instrument lubricate and clean motor clean case in, uh, inspect power cords and plugs inspect controls and switches ensure Appropriate menu settings for a proper use, ensure tightness of the rotor, check the lights and indicators, verify that alarm are operating properly, ensure safety switch is functioning if refrigerated, ensure temperature reading is working, replace or repair gaskets, seals and vacuum pump if applicable. Common failures in that operation of the centrifuge that was machine will not start 
power supply is faulty may sometimes it happens common failures in that operation safety switch or timer not working properly motor not working properly motor making noise rotor is broken lead will not open or close that common failures we avoid it by checking it before okay that's also content thank you for a